That one's done. Okay, let's bring in another one. Oh my God, they definitely, <laughs> not the same. <laughs> I'm guessing, I'm guessing it's just a couple liters low, so. Not just a hat rack, Johnny. Got, no, you, smart brain, smart. Oh, you know, like hat rack. Hat rack no, I said not just a hat rack. Oh, look at that. I think it's gas. It smells like gas. That looks pretty full. It's not full until it spills. You don't have to stand on it. You just go like this. Can't. Yeah. Not quite the same. It's not bad, but you can hear the smack. So, and that one is a 34 inch as well. We experimented back and forth a few times. So anyways, let's check the oil on this thing. Oh, we can put some more in there. Full is like right full. Pretty full. I can't come much more, or it's gonna come out the out the thing. See, there's a tiny air bubble here. Probably could have gotten up the two milliliters in there. I said it's one of my favorite things to do is take a brand new sled and start making it your own. So full tank gas, full of oil, chain case oil, coolant. Oh shit. I wonder. Oh, not even a sandwich to eat. Looks like I don't get to eat until I put some lightweight parts on it. That's a happy little number. That's this particular one. It was 541 for the exact same model last year. Um, so it'd be Gen 4, as far as a Gen 4, uh, 154, naturally aspirated was about, and there's some variance in between sleds, honestly, you know, different things are different, uh, you know, tracks probably. There's some, a little small amount of variance in the weight of the tracks. Um, and so 532, that's a pretty good number because last year it was 542. So, well, I thought it was five pounds, but maybe it's closer to 10 pounds. And the wrenches are inside for the clutches and all the tools. So that's a good number to start with. I like that. One of the little tidbits about the Gen 4 or Shelley's first mod project here was we actually had a model year 23 track. So that is a light track. And, but we'd went from a 154 to a 165, so that's important to remember too. If we would have just did straight 154 to 154, it would have been lower numbers for sure, skid frame and obviously track. But this, we'll do the same project with this thing, be a 154 and we're gonna turn it into a 165. So I'm excited. This is gonna be a fun one.